Testing, testing, one, two, three, are you there? Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is all goodsies. So welcome to my very first... <laughs> Not so berry challenge. So the very first thing for the not so berry challenge generation one is mint so my thought of mint is green generally green look like greens so i made this big old green house let's uh yeah i i got my chess slave doing chess so that he can get his logic skill up um but yeah this uh big old house here is my Minty green wonderland. Ooh, Elijah's got his logic skill up. Huzzah! But yeah, like um, this big old green house is where our wonderful guy Elijah here. Uh, his name is Elijah Harper. I just randomized his name. Da 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 da, and it turned out to be a nice name. Uh, boom 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 boom, and he's only at his house for a few minutes now, and. Well, people keep on coming into his home. I mean, I get it, because, like, they're his neighbors, but this is still weird. Oh, so let me give you a tour. Um, I wanted to give this sort of an earthy, greensy vibe, because he is a vegetarian. So I also put these little pots over here, so he could grow um, his own food, which I... Over, as somebody who's from the city, I know a lot of people actually like the idea of growing their own vegetation. Possibly even getting, you know, very fresh food. And what's the freshest way to get food but to grow it yourself? Um, okay, so we're back on the first floor. Here's like an inner scope of the house I made. Yeah, I... I a lot of this actually came from the Cool Kitchens pack, which I, I don't know, I love that, that pack. I, I think it's gorgeous. Gorgeous. But, like, a lot of that stuff, it has, like, some very uh, new kitchen stuff that looks super cute. You know, I forgot to put a drain board here. That is such a... <laughs> Okay, I guess you guys in the gallery, you can add this and know that I didn't intentionally leave it so that there's no drain board there. But yeah, um, so yeah, I actually have a lot of fun doing builds. I'm not the best at it though, so there's that. <laughs> but like part of this challenge isn't the build. I just kind of wanted to have him in a greenhouse. Um... But it doesn't really say anything about it, the house having to match you. I just thought, you know, it'd be kind of cool. So, but yeah, like, the challenge was made by somebody called Lil Simsy. Pretty sure you know her. She's pretty popular. Um, I believe she also said that somebody else worked on it called Always Simming. I don't know who they are, but, um... I hope that isn't held against me because um, I don't really watch a lot of um, YouTubers. Not a lot. I mean, it's not per personally a thing that I, you know, do purposefully. It's just I, I watch certain YouTubers like Jay and Veggie and all of them. And a lot of the Sims YouTubers, um, I guess they get not as noticed as much like in comparison to the more popular ones I mean I love Lauren's side and I love um, Claire Siobhan but like I do notice that a lot of the other Sims YouTubers don't get as much love and it really sucks like I know that, like, EA just acknowledged Mira X Mirror, despite the fact that most of her stuff is, I believe, on Twitch. Like, her main stuff. And 
I still think that's super cool because, you know, as a minority myself, I actually do enjoy the fact that there is such opportunity for us in the gaming community, you know? So, let's see. I think it's the gloves I'm looking for are called box room. Yeah, here we go. Box room gloves. Yeah, it it has no purpose other than being cute and decorative, but I like to always include it when I put in the drain board along with this thing of plates to make it look like, hey, well, we we just finished doing the dishes. Yeah, but like I guess you 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 guys are probably going to have to add your own thing to the house if you download it from the gallery. Um uh, you know, I should actually check this, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to focus it on my build. I guess you, you'll just have to see for yourself. Oh, he's doing pretty good in chess. Let me put the wall down. Yeah, I made him into a chess slave. Where I just forced him to continuously play chess and, and now he's talking to himself. God, poor guy. You're already fitting the scientist aesthetic so well. Uh, okay, you know, I, I think I put him in Windenburg. So, I'm guessing these are the birds that are in Windenburg. Some pigeons. Windenburg is very much like New York then. Because <laughs> we got pigeons up the wazoo. Okay. Poor guy. This looks so sad. I'm sorry. It's just like, I'm watching him play chess and I'm like, this is the saddest thing in the world. Oh, so he made some friends. More like they walked into his house unannounced. So there's this guy, um, Eric Lewis. And this lady, um, Nina Caliente. I don't know them very well. Um, what's this? Oh, that's pretty cool. So I guess if you were, you know, you had a kid in your family, you can just like, you have to come home at nine o'clock, missy. But ma'am. <laughs> I guess it, it, this situation would be, but dad. <laughs> He's doing pretty good, though. I mean, I just want him to build up his logic skill since... Part of this thing is not cheating to get the skills up. Which it heart it breaks my heart. Breaks my heart. But yeah. I gotta max out his skills, so doing it the old fashioned way. Mental workout, cool beans. That's a cool thing. Uh this guy he had an achievement the moment he came into this house where he was just like I love all of the things and the people and the things. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's because I made him materialistic and this house is just so full of stuff. I mean, not really if you think about it. I mean, it's only got two rooms. I mean, this is actually one of the smaller builds I've done. But it's still really nice. Like, I, I, I you can tell I put a lot of work into the kitchen. Like, look at this kitchen. Look at it. It's beautiful. It's such a beautiful kitchen dining room setup. And if they... I, I spoke to someone earlier. I think his name is Trippity D. Trippy D. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna screw this up. But he's a Sims YouTuber. Pretty close in numbers as I am. Um, let me check him on Twitter. He's in my giveaway. Oh, don't forget, on the 14th, I'm going to be announcing who's going to be winning my giveaway for Get Famous. So help me get famous. <laughs> okay. Um, I want to give a proper shout out to my boy. Okay, yeah, Trippy D. Yeah, he did, he did not too long ago a really, really cool uh, kitchen build. I like kitchen builds. 
I think they're super cute. So I'm probably gonna like post it down in the description so you guys can go to his channel. You know, help out your fellow YouTuber. Let them blossom. Let them grow. So someday they can be the Lauren Sides, the Pixelades, the Claire Shabons. Because, like, Claire's gonna get old at some point, and we need somebody else under the ranks. Then again, you know, old Claire might still be cute. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just thinking, Hello there! My name is Claire! <laughs> and I am playing The Sims 6! I just built the Villarreal family! They're so cute! So cute! <laughs> oh god. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just thinking old Claire sounds like the most adorable old woman ever. <laughs> but yeah, like we do need to actually start on building the next generation of YouTubers. If YouTubers is a thing, considering how messed up YouTube's been lately. Uh, I mean, I don't think it's entirely their fault, to be honest. I know a lot of people get upset at them for that. But it's like diff. I don't know. I I would assume it's pretty difficult to manage so many accounts. Come on, my dude, keep on building that logic. Oh, he he got he got um another thing for chess. Dude, when did you get here? What what the hell? They're multiplying! Why do people keep walking into his house? It's not even the welcome wagon! Who are you? Dominic Friars. Well, you guys are going to be tossed out a window pretty soon if you keep multiplying. Are you related to this guy? No, you're a totally different family, so what the hell are you doing here? And why are you cleaning? Then again, you know, I don't mind that. You know, that's pretty cool, actually. You know, have a. At least he's doing stuff, dude. This guy, he's a peach. You and the, the lady, uh, the kind of ugly lady. I mean, I don't know why her last name is hot, but she's kind of ugly. Um. And again, maybe I just am biased and I hate the way these Sims look naturally. I mean, look how pretty my boy is. He's he's a he's a pretty boy. He's so minty fresh. Mm, minty fresh. Oh, here she is. I mean, I think she could actually look better. I'm gonna give her a makeover at some point. Yeah, I mean, like if they're gonna be biffles and hang out at the house, I probably will give them all a makeover. Gotta use the green toilet. Use the green toilet. Oh yeah, I put the washer and dryer in here because I thought, you know, it's close to water. But but is he still playing chess? I think he's playing chess. Doopity doopity do. Yeah, you know, while there's a bunch of people here, he should probably try to bring up his mischief skill. Um, yo, ugly lady, you're probably gonna be my first victim. He's gotta bring up his mischief. He's gotta. Okay. Oh, that just seems mean. Invite to fake party. What's that spot? Um. Yeah, a lot of these seem really mean. Um. And I think sometimes this actually kills people, so that would be sad. So, I'm gonna do what's that spot. Dun 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 dun. We don't wanna kill our new best friends. New best friends. New best friends. We don't wanna kill our new best friends. Do 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 do. Dude, why are you constantly watching my big green TV? It's all fabulous and all, but I mean, still. What? Oh my god! Where are you people coming from? Like... Who are you? Don't you live in-
in the city? I mean, I'm pretty sure Victor Fung lives in the city. Did he literally come this far to just talk to Nina Caliente in our house? And yeah, and look, there's more people coming here. I did not, like, start a group gathering. Uh, wait, um, troublemaker. Oh. So, Nina, why are you arguing with a small child? Okay, is this Victor's kid? No, it just happens to be a random small child. There are people just randomly coming into this house. She's like, I'm so angry. I'm a little angry gremlin with the llama hat. That should be fan art. I'm a little angry gremlin with the llama hat. Boop, boop, boom, boom. Lady, you came over to my house to use my computer? <gasps> Do, does he have a person to play chess with? No. They're just, they're just gonna chat while he's playing chess. What happened to Nina? We still need to do mischief to her. Nina Caliente. She's so caliente. Not really. <laughs> oh, come on, little girl. Stop being so angry. She's like, look at you. You're growing up and you're playing chess. You're so boring. How much just make your rug all dirty? My parents aren't here, but I don't care. Maybe I should just do mischief to her. Because, like, she's being a jerk. <sighs> Who is he yelling at? Everyone's going nuts in this house. Nina's back. Nina, Nina, Nina is my Nina. And she's watching TV. She's like watching, uh, I'm guessing, some sort of talk show. It's like, hello there. You know, they don't look like they have Max's hair. Some of these people. I mean, I could be wrong, but some of these people really don't look like they have Max's hair. <gasps> yes! He's building up that logic. That is completely logical. Unlike putting this chair inside of the fire pit. I mean, we should celebrate his newfound logic by... um. Ending the uh, chess playing for a bit and then have him do a little trick. Because, I mean, he needs to build up that mischief. He's like, look at that spot. Look like duty. <laughs> it's like, oh, that's funny. Ha ha ha. Ha ha. Do you like money? Oh, yes, I love clean money. And I don't like dirty things. Ooga booga booga. Oh, that's not nice. But you pulled a trick on me first. No, they, they didn't like that. They like, you know, I was being playful for a bit, but you know, that, that kind of sucked. Awkward encounter. Yo, um, let's see. What, what are they doing? Who the heck made popcorn in my kitchen? Nina! Are you just, like, living off of me? Like, like, are you poor or something? Using my money to make your popcorn. And small child, go home. This is my house. Okay, where, where's, um... Where's the option to tell them to go home? Okay, I think I have to actually introduce myself to Colleen. 
before I can tell her to go home. Colleen is so mean. Colleen is a mean little girl. Colleen, you need to take a chill pill. I mean, you're so colorfully dressed. Why the heck are you so mean? Damn, like, that got him pissed right away. Dude, you can't have a little girl as an enemy. That's weird. Um, try to at least be a little nice to the girl. Like, chat up with Colleen. Colleen! Dude, you can't have a little girl as an enemy. Well, she she likes money like you. He's like, you should value education. No, I value, value grilled cheese. Well, grilled cheese are delicious. I don't want to have anything to do with you, sir. Oh, fine. Don't eat my popcorn. <laughs> okay. Hey, like, these people are just, like, living in my house. Like, you see this. They're not part of the household. They're just living here. And God damn it, this little girl. Someone needs to shoot her into a catapult, and then the catapult will shoot her into the next county. Which, what is the next county to Windenburg? I don't know. <laughs> little girl, go home. Well, uh, they're not enemies anymore, but she needs to go home. She's being a bad little girl. Try to calm down. I mean, I, c I guess we could try calming her down. Like, maybe she's just cranky because she needs a nap or something. <laughs> okay. Um, Let's try calming down the little baby girl. For all we know, she's just a misunderstood little tot. I think not. But hey! <laughs> it's worth a shot. He's eating a bowl of popcorn. Well, this guy's walking around his house in his undies. My dude. These two are a very good looking couple. I'm not gonna lie. They are a very good looking couple. Damn it. Okay, someone needs to kick out this little girl. She's mean. Colleen. You're mean. Okay, um, imply her mom's a llama. Okay, let's uh, do this one. Maybe it'll make her laugh. Mm. Let's just not chat with Colleen and try to do the joke. Maybe she'll be like, ha ha ha, that's funny. I thought that would get pissed off at us some more. Like, she is a mean little girl. Colleen! <laughs> like, like, you came into my house, dude. Like, little girl. You came into my house. She's a cute little girl, though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, okay. So she liked that. Okay, cool. So she likes, like, mischievous things. She's a mischievous little girl. She's a little tricksy girl. Envious. Oh, because of the couples. There, there are a lot of couples in here. Um, well, at least I think so. I mean, wait... Maybe it's just them that's a couple. I mean, I guess just being around couples in general will do that. You know, I'm a, I'm just wondering something. Is Nina kind of like, um, kind of like him in a sense where she's like materialistic and, you know, I'm going to give her a makeover. This is not part of the challenge, but I'm going to give her a makeover. Like, they've come pretty close with each other that she can walk around his house in her undies. So, I'm going to give them a makeover. Okay. Since she's not part of the challenge, this isn't me cheating. And I'm 
done with her. Um, I actually kind of like the way she turned out. Sorry I sped through all of that. It's just, you know. I wanted to make sure I didn't make her the main focus of this episode. But I mean, I'm like, she looks pretty cute. And like, if they're gonna be buds, they they don't they can't be walking around like her looking like a foot. At some point, I might even fix his male friends, but I I, I like her. She's a little thick, but it's okay. So let's get back into the game. So we're back in game and. He is just not having it with this little girl. Colleen, the mean, has just gotten him up the walls. He's like, this little girl needs to get out of my house. So he's going to scold her. He's going to be like, why are you being so mean? This is my house. Go away. So he's going to be like, little girl, you have to stop misbehaving and I'm going to call your parents. I'm already pissed off because I'm lonely. I don't need you. Now go. Go home. You're a cute little girl, but you're mean. Who is your parents, anyway? What? Are you not gonna leave? She's gonna be a troublemaker, kid. Oh, he feels better now. I guess because he shared how he felt. Oh, and somebody took out the garbage and didn't actually throw it away. Globlor! Wait, wait. Who the heck are you? Okay, another child? What What are you doing in my house? Do, do you belong to someone? Why do all these people keep coming over? Wait, why is there a mixologist here? Why is there a mixologist here? I didn't hire one. Why? Oh, jeez. <laughs> Little girl, why are you playing in the garbage and laughing? It's like, little girl, if you want to go take yourself out like the garbage, you know, this isn't the way to do it. And we got another friend here. Vivian Lewis. She probably came here to get this guy here. I'm guessing it's her son. I mean, she looks kind of old and he looks kind of young, so they definitely can't be married. <coughs> But yeah, my house is like the place to go to, apparently. Let's move it to a place where he can actually get to it. Now, go here, dude. My dude. Go and throw away your garbage. Nobody's going to want to come over here if it smells like garbage in here. And these two seem to be getting along. Oh, wait. I think they might be married. Possibly. Wow, like, literally my house is the place to go to for love and all that. Okay, the, the trash is empty, so everything's all good. And he's feeling better because, you know, he he doesn't have to deal with little girl. The the other little girl. I mean, the, the one splashing around the garbage seemed to be a nice little girl. But, like... Colleen the mean is, is really a menace to society. The only menace to society should be me. Me. Elijah Harper. Yeah, I forgot my character's name right away. <laughs> okay, Elijah. Next episode will probably work on your whole science-y stuff. Logic, you seem to have down pack. So, talk to you guys later. 
If you enjoyed this, like, comment, and subscribe for more spastastic content. And I love you guys. Stay awesome. Bye bye. Mwah. So you know what time it is. It's time to thank my Phantom Squad. Bum ba da bum bum. Top tier. These are the simmers, the YouTubers to be, the lovers, the fighters, the punchers in the face of anyone who likes Dunkin' Donuts. One who achieves beyond reality and beyond the love that I can ever, ever imagine. They are perfect, they are beautiful, they're contributors, and they are the most amazing people to speak to on Twitter. Yeah, follow me on Twitter at Phantom Celebi. So here we go. Here is to Jazz the Chameleon, Potato underscore, Bunch of Numbers, Edie Rose 45, Cute Girl Sims, Calorie underscore, Akin Maloon X5, Carissa and Prismatic Simmer, and Laura. <laughs> okay, so hope you guys enjoyed that. Come back for another video. See you soon. Bye-bye.